My name is Flash Isaac and I'm a teacher from the future. When I was much younger, I saw thousands and thousands of people fail jam and unable to gain admission. This made me travel in time. Now I am back with the Flash Letter Jam app and a series on YouTube tagged 120 Days to Jam. My mission is to help you blast jam and as well get justice for everyone who jam has served breakfast. You are welcome to a beautiful episode of the 120 Days to Jam Physics with Flash Isaac. In this episode, we shall be looking at types of sound that you should know. Before I embark on my procedures, it is imperative for you to understand what frequency actually is when it comes to waves and what period is. Frequency is the number of waves in one second. If you look at one second, so how many waves do we have in this one second? That is frequency. Which you can also say that frequency is the number of oscillation per second. When you hear number first before time, you are dealing with frequency. Frequency is inversely proportional to period, which means frequency is 1 over period. What is period? Period is the time taken for one complete wave or the time taken for one complete oscillation. So, if we are saying number before time, that is frequency. Time before number, that is period. So, period is focused on time, while frequency is focused on the number of waves or the number of oscillations. There is something called the fundamental sound. Fundamental in sound. Fundamental is sound of the highest frequency. When we are giving sound, the one with the highest frequency is the fundamental. This fundamental is the sound of strongest, single and audible frequency. The sound of strongest, single frequency and audible. This is fundamental. And we have octaves. Octaves. Octave is a sound or sound of two times the fundamental frequency. So if fundamental is F, octaves will therefore be 2F, two times the fundamental frequency. So fundamental is the sound of the strongest frequency, sound of single frequency, and sound of audible frequency. You can hear octaves is a sound or sound of two times the fundamental frequency. We have the harmonics. Harmonics. Harmonics are sounds of the multiples of fundamental frequency. Now, if I say multiple, let's say one fundamental frequency, two fundamental frequency, three fundamental frequency, four fundamental frequency and so on. All these are multiples of fundamental frequency. In this case, this is first harmonic. We can say H1. Yeah, two times fundamental frequency. This is the second harmonic, H2. Then, this will be third harmonic, H3. This is the fourth harmonic, H4. The fifth harmonic will be five times fundamental frequency this is h5 once again harmonics are multiples of the fundamental frequency and don't forget fundamental frequency is like sound of a single frequency let's call it one or the strongest frequency audible frequency now if you say 
twice the fundamental frequency, you are going to get octaves. Now, we are looking at various multiples of the fundamental frequency. This is the fundamental frequency itself, F. Now, when you start the multiple, like two times the fundamental frequency, you are not dealing with harmonics. This is the second harmonics. If you say three times the fundamental frequency, this is the third harmonics. Four times the fundamental frequency, this is the fourth harmonics. Fifth times the fundamental frequency, this is the fifth harmonic. Six times the fundamental frequency, that is the sixth harmonic. Like that, like that, like that. Now, overtone. Overtone is the frequency above and multiple of fundamental frequency. Multiple of fundamental frequency. The frequency above or multiple of fundamental frequency. Frequency. Now look at the relationship between fundamental frequency, overtone, and harmonics. Please look very, very carefully. If this is your fundamental frequency, a single frequency, I told you that the multiple of this fundamental frequency is harmonics. I mean, if you start counting from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, you have what we call harmonics. So, one fundamental frequency, you can say first harmonic, two times fundamental frequency, second harmonic, three, F, four, F, five, F, six, F, and so on. All these are harmonics. Now, over two starts from the second harmonics, which means this is your first overtone, this is your second overtone, this is your third overtone, this is your fourth, this is your fifth, like that. So, the second overtone is your third fundamental frequency. Your third overtone is your fourth fundamental frequency. Your fourth overtone is the fifth fundamental frequency. Your fifth overtone is the sixth fundamental frequency. But a time comes where there will be a problem with this analysis. Why would there be a problem? You will soon be dealing with open pipes. And closed pipes open pipes and closed pipes open pipe is a pipe where both ends are open a closed pipe is a pipe where one end is open and the other end is closed now when one end is open and another end is open there is a character the pipe possesses it has what we call odd harmonics. Odd harmonics. So a closed pipe, we have odd harmonics. What does it imply? Closed pipe will not have the fourth fundamental frequency. It will not have sixth. It will not have eighth. It will not have ten. It will only have the odd numbers, which implies that. A pipe with one end closed or a closed pipe, the harmonics that will be present will be 1F, 3F, 5F, 7F, and so on. From this observation, a closed pipe will not have second harmonic. It does not have second harmonic because it only comprises of odd harmonics now look at this for open pipes all these harmonics and over two we apply what i've been explaining since we apply like this because flow open pipes they have all the 
multiples of fundamental frequency. So for open pipe, the first overkin is the second harmonic or the second fundamental frequency. The second overkin is the third harmonic or the third fundamental frequency. But for pipe closed on one end or a closed pipe, these are the harmonics present. So over tune, we start from here. We definitely start from the next possible harmonic. So here is the first over in, here is the second, and here is the third. So for a closed pipe, the first over tone is the three fundamental frequency, the third fundamental frequency. For a closed pipe, the second over tone is the fifth fundamental frequency. For a closed pipe, the third over tune is the seventh fundamental frequency. So you see, the fourth over tune will be the next odd fundamental frequency, not eight. That is what you should know about open pipes and closed pipes. Beats are strobing sound produced when two sounds of nearly equal pitch or frequency are combined to give us a common sound or a single sound with a common frequency or a single common frequency sound. If I have one sound here, whoo, and I have another sound, ha. I combine the two sounds since they are nearly of the same pitch or nearly of the same frequency, then I'm able to get one sound, combine the two sounds to one to get one sound with common frequency. So, I've been able to produce a beat. And beats are very, very important in music. Then, ultrasonic sounds are sound of frequency above the hearing range. The human ear has limits. There is a sound that you cannot hear. So, the sound is beyond the frequency that is hearable. Any sound above 2000 Hz is an ultrasonic sound because that frequency is below the hearing range. Now you may be wondering, if we have a sound of frequency below the hearing range, how come we still need that frequency? What do we use it for? It is important in medical and surgical of, uh, diagnosis. Yes, we use ultrasonic. Then it is also important in, in brake parts of cars and aeroplanes to test the lining whether they are very, very okay. Ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to the end of this episode. Get the flash, then I'll jump up and begin to play with questions. Subscribe to this channel if you've not. Tell your friends about it. And feel free to reach out to me if you have questions or queries. There are also flash learners applications for your other examinations. They are going to help you. See you in the next